Today's telecast is being presented live from Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena. And Bricks, we've got some major star sightings today. Oh, look, there's Tom Shanks. And there's Tyler Scary. And oh, oh, that's Jennifer Gorings. Wow. <laughs> Are those things real or fake, you think, Grim? Well, if you're talking about those two big chihuahuas she's holding, yep, they look real to me, Power. Both teams hit the field, ready to hit each other in this MFL matchup. The Blitzburg Steelheads battle, the Los Scandalous Dam. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> The paddy wagons in the parking lots are full. The familiar scent of bodily fluids in the air. And the men's room is both flooding and on fire. And that means NFL game day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Man, last week some mutant let out a lava blast in one of the stalls in the men's room. Place went up like an oil rig. Flames and explosions. Water shooting out of where the toilets were. <laughs> I electrocuted myself using the electric hand dryer. I wish they had paper towels at least as an option. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? <laughs> Third down and the offense needs a miracle. foot into that one and he snags the punt and looks for open field I had a dog named Stance. oh that was a big hit hey bricks i bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career ah uh, let's see about a quarter after three grim but my watch is a bit slow first down he was not going to drop that one they need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that. But she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second and eight to go. First down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Is the game over yet? I gotta go to the vet to have him reattach my big toe to where my thumb was again. It just fell off for the third time today. I was barely even chewing on it. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. 
And they needed that big run right there, Bricks. They sure fucking did, Grim. They sure fucking did. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two. This is your brain, and this the quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. This guy's a brick shit house. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and 10. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for something. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got to... Uh... <clears throat> And this game is up for grabs. First down and five. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. Chip wearing a wig. And it's first.
first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two. Man, about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth thrown out of the roof of my mouth? What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something You Need? Watch yourself. That's unique. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Third and two. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. They just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two. Uh, if I was that QB, I'd be pissed. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in time, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. point attempt. He 
goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep him guessing. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Much like my wedding night, there was a big explosion, and then everyone left disappointed. What do you mean, everyone? Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Well, that's two timeouts burned, and you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, MFL isn't episodic, Bricks. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. First and ten. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. <laughs> and they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. A hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Red, did I kill him? It's a touchdown! I never looked that good dancing, and I have skin. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good! Yeah. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. With a brutal hit. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Ah, uh, save it. Prince's ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well placed cleat. <laughs> And 
it. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. Oh, with the punishing hit. Second down and five. Nice hit. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. A pickup of about three on that play. when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. First and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Passes it for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for, you know what? Never mind. Second down and more than the QB would like. It's a six-yard gain. Third down and eight. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. It's called a first down. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. 
And it's first and ten. his way out of that tent. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Second down and long. He had it for a second there. Third down and the punter is warming up. Target more often. And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Hey, yeah, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down in a mile. Like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. It looks like the defense handed our shrinking pills. Uh, that's a chance the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Take the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. Third down and ten. For a kick this far, you just gotta kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim! It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. The kick is good. Well, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's
It's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Third down, and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. And the defense calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Don't make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. Second and three. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. No, I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. Third down in. The punter is warming up. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. 
straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because this guy's full on berserk. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo grim. First and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. One in for the first down. First down and six. He picks up five on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And the defense. The idea is to kill the defensive player, not your own guy. That receiver has to move away from the ball marker. First down in a mile. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. One, hot two, hot three. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You got to make that catch. Third down and never going to happen. Hot one, hot two, hot three. It's two yard run before he stopped. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. The defense anticipated a pass there and put an end to their offensive drive. Like my wife always said, not tonight. And it's first and ten.
And they line up for the extra point. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. One, two, three. my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Third down, and the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? At some point, they're going to need to put this ref out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hint. Dirty tricks attack the ref. Third down and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense. And they just smacked that one back in his face. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. First down and one. <laughs> the defense calls their last timeout. I don't know if they can pull off a win, Glenn. Why is that, Bricks? Uh, just a gut feeling. It also might be that porterhouse I ate for breakfast. How are you still alive? Drugs. And he runs it in for the touchdown. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And he picks up the loose ball and rumbles into the end zone for the score. Nice going. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn return? 
return of Grimm. Now players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just... The band walk away victorious today. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, that I have a tell you... Let's listen to MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. I'm a... Grim Blitrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.